You have interfered with our affairs for the last time. Sinatra. I am literally in the air right now, wrapping up a store. This first class, I am so new at this. What's going on, guys? It's your boy Mars back with another Clash Royale video. And guys, in today's video, I'm showing you a 2.6 balloon cycle deck. I saw this deck being used in the top 1,000 on ladder, so let's take a look at it. All right, guys. So here's the deck right here. It's gonna be Balloon Miner with Archers and Hunter. And yeah, guys, looking at this deck, we have 2.6 cycle. We've got Electro Spirit Skeletons to play some good defense. We have two small spells. And yeah, let's just hop into some games and see if we can get some wins. All right, guys, first game here against Say My Name. And guys, we have Balloon in our starting hand. We're just gonna go in. Guys, Naked Balloon at the bridge, first play. And this dude is gonna go with a Golem. Oh my God. Why would he do that? Oh, he's gonna tornado. Wait, but he missed. Another hit. Oh, okay. He, at least he's not gonna get King Tower activated right there, guys. Psych! That's the wrong number! Oh! Wait, what? That activates King Tower? Guys, that's a little bit questionable right there. I don't I don't know about that one, but we're gonna go uh, with a miner in the safe spot and some skeletons. And then we're gonna go Electro Spirit and Archers. And yeah, I think we're gonna lose our tower here, guys. Um, yeah, Golem is not the matchup that we were looking for with this deck. Uh, can these archers stay alive, though? And no, I don't think they're going to, guys. Um, he did spam his Mega Minion at the bridge, though. So hopefully we can take his tower here um, if we go Balloon Miner. But yeah, guys, I don't know how he got away with that. I mean... Actually, I do know how he got away with that. He has a really easy matchup because he has Baby Dragon, Electro Dragon, Mega Minion, and Tornado. And at least we do get a hit right there. And we're going to take that tower. But guys, as far as, you know, actually defending in this game, I'm not sure what we're going to do. Uh, we can go with this. We can go with Skeletons up here. And, you know, we can counter this stuff after a while. But yeah... E-Drag goes down. I mean, we can go in for another Balloon, but as long as he, like, is able to place a Golem on the map, I don't know how we're going to be able to get rid of it. Let's just go Balloon uh, with Archers. And, yeah, Archers are going to be able to take out the Mega Minion, hopefully. And, oh, I missed the Snowball, though. But, yeah, he has Tornado, too. So, guys, we're starting off with almost about as tough of a matchup as we can possibly get. And, you know, we're going to see if we can overcome it, guys. We're going to go Balloon over here. And, yeah, then we're going to go Archers. And, yeah, Mega Minion is going to die to the Archers. So, let's see, guys. Can we get that Balloon to the tower? Uh, we're going to go Hunter here with an Electro Spirit. And try to cycle to another Hunter, hopefully. We're actually going to go Balloon Miner for the 3 Crown. Because we have to cycle and we have to uh, apply pressure. Um, but yeah, guys, we're gonna go with another, uh, we're actually gonna snowball here on his king tower, but yeah, guys, in terms of defending, I just can't really do anything. We can go hunter here, but yeah, we weren't able to take his tower, and guys, that's what happens, uh, when you face golem when you're trying to use 2.6 balloon cycle. Alright, guys, into our second game here, and I think I'm gonna show that first one just because it was pretty close, and, you know, it was a tough matchup, and we still actually made it pretty close, so I think it was a pretty good game. We're just going to cycle a couple cards here at the bridge. Barb Barrel, Electro Spirit, and nice. We do get a couple hundred damage with that, so we'll take that any day of the week, guys. This guy's going to have Royal Ghost and Barb Barrel, so see if this matchup can be any better for me here than the last one. We're going to go Miner in the back, and yeah, he's going to have Fisherman, so, you know, I think he's going to have a Hunter. Ooh, is he going to have Hunter and Electro Wizard? We're about to find out here, guys, because if he has Hunter on the left side, that is going to be... Oh, no, guys. He has Hunter and Electro Wizard, and let's just say that is not what we really want to see here, guys. Um, he has Hunter coming in with his RG. We can go with a Snowball there, and I should have placed my Hunter closer, that's for sure. But we can go Skeletons here, and wow, guys, his RG takes half my tower, though. Guys, this is another, like, weird matchup where I don't know what we can really do here. But, yeah, Hunter is going to lock onto his Fisherman. And, yeah, at least his Fisherman is gone. And he's got a Ghost coming in. So we can go with, like, a Bar Barrel like this. But one thing is clear, guys. We're going to have to try to cycle as many Balloons as possible on this guy's Tower if we want any chance of winning here. 
Hopefully the ghost doesn't get a hit, and nice, it doesn't. Um, you're gonna have to snowball here. Um, he logs though, so guys, clearly we're still down one or two elixir. Which, oof. Uh, we're gonna go balloon here, and then we're gonna minor. Yeah, we gotta try to predict here, guys, if we wanna win this game. We're gonna go electro spirit here too, and yeah, I think we might be able to get his tower, guys. Not sure why he went hunter, but he goes fireball, and ooh, did we get a hit? Oh, those skeletons were... Okay, never mind. That's gonna work out fine. Um, you know, I don't know if we got a hit there or not. I didn't even see, but I think we're doing okay here, guys. We can balloon here, and he's gonna have to hunter. So yeah, we tried to predict it with the snowball. I don't know if that's gonna get me anything, but looks like we will, um, get some damage right there. We can elite... We can e-spirit here to bring this ghost over a little bit. And then, ooh, guys, we have to try to kill this royal ghost as fast as possible, though. Is he gonna take my tower with that royal ghost? Okay, no, luckily it stays at 410. And can we snowball here on this stuff? Uh-oh, guys. Yeah, his hunter's gonna be able to counter that. Um, you know, archers are not gonna be able to kill that yet. We can hunter here, though, and then skeletons and miner here. Because his royal ghost is not gonna take that, guys. He's at 862, though. If he goes in for one RG on the left, I think we lose. Um, you know, I think we gotta just cycle, like, archers here. Oh, he has fireball, though, guys. C totally forgot about that. Uh, we can hunter here, though. Go for a bar barrel. Go for skeletons. Go for a snowball. But with one RG hit, he takes it. And, yeah, guys, wow. We're 0-2 with the deck, but I can't even say we're playing bad. I mean, we gotta try to bounce back with a win here. We're gonna go archers in the back, and guys, we don't really have the hand that we need, though. I wish I had balloon. Um, he's gonna go with a fireball there, though. So it's definitely minor here, and guys, he has level six skeletons. So I'm hoping that, you know, I'm hoping this is a fair game. I'm hoping he doesn't have like really low level cards, but he does have a level nine musketeer and a level nine cannon. And okay, we are able to get one balloon hit there, though. Guys, looking like 2.6 hog here. See if we can bar barrel to get rid of the musky. And nice, we're able to fully counter that. And yeah, we're going to snowball here on these skeletons. And wow, I only hit one of the skeletons, guys. So what a play on my part. We can hunter and electro spirit and try to get rid of this hog rider. He's going to get two hits though, I think. But yeah, guys, this is much more up, up my alley in terms of a matchup for this deck. So I'm definitely happy about that. Uh, he is gonna musket or he's gonna cannon over there so let's go with balloon and it's not gonna get pulled by that cannon guys so he's gonna have to fully counter it with the musketeer and with his musketeer shooting the miner uh hopefully we can snowball here and nice we get a hit and guys that's basically gonna be tower it's also gonna hit the musky and let's just go with um we're gonna go with a bar barrel here yeah he does go with a hog but we can get a hunter in and yeah hopefully he only gets like two hits and nice we're keeping both of our towers at 1900 um his tower's at 72 so it two snowballs could take it or this hunter shot nice the hunter gets a hit guys and hopefully we can bounce back and win this game after those two rough matchups i mean we face golem and rg and you know maybe this deck right here wouldn't be the best deck for ladder because if you're facing golem and rg you do not want to be using this deck, but we're going to go with just an Electro Spirit here. Stop his um, Ice Spirit from connecting. And, ooh, if the Miner had gotten one more hit on his Musky, then we would have probably gotten a hit on his King Tower. But he's going to go pretty aggressive here with Hog and Log. And we can go Balloon Miner. Guys, what is he fireballing? He didn't hit anything with that fireball. We can go Skeletons and Archers here uh, to get rid of the Cannon really quick. Get the balloon to his tower. Um, the miner's getting hits on his tower. And nice. We get a hit. And we're going to take him down to... Uh, with the death damage, we take him down to 984. I'm trying to predict his hog here with a hunter. And he's just going to fireball. But guys, he needs to hog. Why did he take so long to drop his hog rider, guys? Yeah, we're able to keep our tower there, but uh, honestly, I wanted to take his second tower. All right, guys, another game here against Freezing Silver, and we finally got a nice win in our last one. So we'll try to see if we can compound that into two quick wins here to end off the video. 
gonna go balloon electro spirit here to start off the video though or start off the game and he's gonna have a tesla so a little bit unfortunate uh he's gonna be able to counter that do we get death damage i'm pretty sure that's death damage guys so nice we'll take that oh we don't have hunter though gonna have to just go skeletons and then hunter and he gets one shot so he has tesla hog so you don't usually see those together that much but we'll see what he has here he's gonna have valkyrie and we can just minor in the back i think i think one of the keys with this deck is you have to use the minor on defense a little more than you would think um but ooh, he's gonna go princess there and in terms of you know getting rid of a princess we have the bar barrel we have the snowball but minor is going to be one of our better cards in terms of getting rid of a princess but we are going to have to minor for this mini pekka yeah because i did not trust those two skeletons right there guys but we're going to go balloon here uh with this minor coming in because i don't think the tesla pulls it and nice guys we can go archers here his tesla is shooting the balloon but it's on his tower and we're going to get one hit right there plus death damage again he does get one hit with the Valkyrie, but we're still up like 900 now or 800 or so. Ooh, he has Goblin Barrel. I mean, it makes sense that he has Goblin Barrel with the Princess, but wow, guys, he, he has Goblin Barrel and Wall Breakers. I wonder why he wasn't playing those cards to start the game. Um, honestly, yeah, we're going to go Hunter here and then Miner. And um, guys, he has Hog Rider, Wall Breakers and goblin barrel and so no wonder he's having trouble defending some of our pushes because if we get rid of his tesla he has nothing for the balloon so that's pretty nice honestly uh we're just gonna go balloon here because we can force him to tesla whenever we want and yeah he's gonna have to right there and guys now we are gonna outcycle this tesla we're gonna go skeletons archers minor his princess and then just go in with another balloon yeah guys because he just used his tesla and he's gonna try to cycle back to it here probably but maybe we can snowball it and get nice guys he just wasn't able to get it down in time we're gonna take tower here uh we can take a mini pack a hit right there are we gonna lose tower though to these wall breakers oh the snowball with the electro spirit oh my gosh guys that was huge and his hog's only gonna take me to 700 uh princess is not on the tower we can get rid of her with the archers and guys i think we won wow oh he does have goblin barrel gotta go skeletons and hunter and we're able to keep it at 516 but guys he that hog isn't gonna break through nice guys we're able to win a weird matchup against hog goblin barrel wall breakers but anyways guys if you made it this far in the video make sure to click like and subscribe right now doing those little things takes like one or two seconds but it benefits my channel tremendously and i really appreciate it i hope you guys enjoyed today's battles with the 2.6 balloon cycle deck it was tough to get going at first we faced golem and rg and we had a lot of trouble defending but then we faced two hog cycle decks and we definitely did a lot better so this 2.6 balloon cycle deck definitely does a lot better against other cycle decks and if you're facing beatdown you might be in for a loss but anyways guys hope you enjoyed today's battles and thank you so much for watching today's video and i'll see you guys in a couple days with another clash royale video